Hey Scorpio, it's going to be a love reading for you guys, okay? General love reading. Could be dealing with the air sign. A Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Oh, okay. Somebody here could be having money issues or pretending that they have money. Um, this is somebody who like, you know, somebody here is putting on a show or a front. Okay. Maybe somebody's getting ready to spend some money. I don't know. Taking shortcuts. Uh, as soon as I say spending money, spirit's like, no, nah, I don't think so. <laughs> Ooh, somebody is lazy. They're not fulfilling their commitments or they're causing more work for other people here. Um, or somebody just not doing their job well. This could be just somebody here like that's just losing money in general or in business or having trouble in finances. This could be um, someone who who hides behind material things, you know, or like cares about how something looks on the outside. But like, they, you know, this person could look really good all the time. Like you see this person out in the streets, right? But the bank account might not be, you know, bank account might be on zero. I'm just saying, I don't know. I'm just showing, I'm, listen, I'm just reading the cards. You see this. I'm just reading the cards. Whoever this person is, they like watches. They could love watches. They, like I said, they might dress well. They might look good. Um, have a matching outfit. Have a matching set. Male or female. Okay. But in reality, this person is taking shortcuts. Like robbing Peter to pay Paul type energy. Show me what's going on between the collective and their twin. Now, if this is not your twin, maybe that's somebody's energy around them or somebody's energy around you or it could be you. I'm just saying. Queen B. All right. Now we have the divine feminine energy. This is like the divine feminine energy card for me. This is somebody who's literally in empress energy. This is somebody who's boss, a boss, you know, um, you could be a boss or a manager at work. Okay, somebody here is focused on their finances and there's somebody else here who I feel like is having problems with their finances. If you're in this divine feminine energy, you, mm, yeah, you're actually leveling up. Your, your money's growing. You're bossing up. You could be an Aries, Leo or a Sagittarius. Also, you could be a fire sign or your person could be a fire sign. This fire sign could be the one who's fake flexing or like super materialistic. Show me what else is going on between the collective and their twin. Thank you. Controlling. Okay, so this is giving me um, a little bit of, because you know, Aries here, fire sign energy, Aries. Controlling is giving me emperor energy also. Does not have to be, but like somebody here you're dealing with this. If they're if you're dealing with an Aries, this person is definitely like in control, or this person is an emperor energy, right? They could be a boss too, but there's something funny going on with their money, or somebody's taking shortcuts some kind of way, somehow, because I feel like they have to right now. Somebody overspent or under calculated or something. Side message, okay, shady. Yeah, see, somebody is doing something shady. Or you can feel like this person who's really controlling, this person who um, kind of likes to have their way, control the situation or people. This person is <clears throat> being dishonest with you about something. Show me what else. Or they were dishonest with you. Show me what else for the twin. Mm. This energy of somebody just burn, burning through money is burning a hole in somebody's pocket, or, or somebody just literally was like not doing what they should be doing when it comes to their money and their finances. Like, either somebody's spending it faster than they can earn it, or also, here somebody could be married, okay, or in a long term commitment, or this could be somebody you used to be married to. Apply that where it fits. Let me see what's on the bottom of the deck. Lust. This situation involves lust and passion and physical attraction. And then boom, we have gold digger, a user. Somebody using people for money or material benefits. And then we have butting heads here. So you or, or your twin is dealing with somebody like this. Okay, you butted heads with this person because of this. There's some sort of um, fighting or conflict, five of wands energy. 
All right. Show me what else is between the collective and their twin. Okay. Thank you. We're going to take those. Yeah, your 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 twin pen feels like you are a good list a good listener. Look at what did I say? If your twin is married, they chose money over love. They want you and love you and need you and feel like you're such a great energy. Um, your energy is so great and you're such a great listener, right? You're in this queen bee energy. Lord have mercy. I I don't see that coming. Look at this. And I said your energy is positive and whoever this person is married to or in a long term commitment with or like whoever this other person is, maybe they're the one who's burning money. I don't know. Right. Spending this person's money. This person's energy is definitely negative. <clears throat> But your 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 divine counterpart needs you. I'm ready to step. I'm ready for this next step. Let's grow together. I don't know if this person, you know, are you feeling what I'm feeling? Okay, let's see. Hmm. So this person could be obviously feel like you can still feel this person's energy here. The connection is pretty strong between the two of you, which makes sense. Your words cut deep. So you, this is giving energy of light. You could have, um, that's too many spirit. Somebody could have some words to exchange with each other or say something that they either regret saying or doing here. Divine feminine, I'm sorry I cheated. Yeah, like I said, somebody did something they regret doing. I'm tired of arguing. Like I said, five of wands energy. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> five of wands energy. You could be dealing with a Leo or a Cancer Pisces or a Scorpio. They're sad and they are definitely sorry they cheated for sure. They wish they would have had the strength not to do what it is that they did to you. Page of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. So somebody here is like thinking about you, watching you. They're curious about what you are doing possibly. You know, keeping tabs on you, watching you on social media, watching you wherever they can. All right. Seven of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. Uh-oh. What was that? Nine of Cups. <clears throat> The Wheel of Fortune. Uh oh, what was that? The Chariot card. <gasps> oh, excuse me. The Two of Wands. There, and there's the Divine Feminine. King of Cups. Bottom of the deck is the Five of Pentacles. All right. Below that is the Three of Swords. Yeah. This is definitely giving the energy of your words cut deep, right? Somebody feels heartbroken, sad, and deep regret for what they did alone. This is like energy of somebody really might even be crying, crying or very upset here. Somebody feels abandoned, left out in the cold. Like you may not be talking to this person. Um, they obviously view you, the divine feminine, as the uh, wish fulfillment with the nine of cups being here. Um, they, they love you. King of cups energy is somebody who <clears throat> is a masculine energy who, you know, is emotional over this ending between the two of you with the wheel being here. They do want to overcome these obstacles with the chariot car. Be, this person might actually be planning to travel towards you. Okay, this for some of you all, you live at a distance from this person and is thinking of this person is thinking about traveling towards you. Okay, this person is kind of like watching and waiting, um, trying to decide whether or not what they're going to do right because seven of the seven of pentacles energy is about waiting. Um, but it's also like, okay, should I invest my time and energy into something and like plant the seed? sowing a seed and watching it grow and waiting for it to grow it's like do I want to do that I mean you know this person is curious if they do that mm. 
I wish I could punch your third eye open. <laughs> you could be dealing with a cancer. Strong cancer here. Uh, fixed sign energy with the um, wheel. Death, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio, Aquarius energy. So someone here is not listening to their intuition. Okay. Or they're not trusting their intuition. Show me more what's going on here with this twin flame yeah see I told you they're posting stuff on social media or they're watching you and keeping tabs on you that could be you or this third party though somebody they definitely want your forgiveness for sure they're very upset this person been praying and thinking about you and they said they they didn't they never meant to hurt you you aren't who they think that you are I mean, yeah, that makes sense, right? Uh, somebody here could love to wear hats, by the way, because this is like the second card that I see here where somebody's wearing a hat. You see how he's wearing a hat here? Can y'all see that? Uh oh, yeah. And then he's wearing a hat here. I'm just, and somebody could have a beard too. Definitely a beard. This King of Cups has a beard too, right? This person said they never meant to hurt you. You aren't, they aren't who you think they are. But I think you know that already. I think you know that already. Uh, I'm, yeah, you know that already. You're very disappointed in their choices. You really are. One, This person wants one last chance. Will you please forgive me? <laughs> oh my goodness. Like, I'm not making it up. Show me what else here. Show me what else here. Yeah, you're like, I don't have any patience for this anymore. I'm done. Somebody feels trapped here. It doesn't how far I run. My heart will always come back to you. Okay, I can still feel your energy. Yeah, this person, like I said, they still feel tied to your energy. Like I said a little bit earlier, right? Okay. I just want to be in your life. Please stop blocking my affection for you. <laughs> reading your old messages has me feeling some type of way. Okay, so this person is reading your messages and they want to talk. Force or force things on you, forces their way, and uses force to get what they want. So this person might like, if you have them blocked, they're going to find a way to come to go around the block. Or they're going to do whatever they can to stay in your life, I feel like. All right, let's see. Mm -mm, what's that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I told you. They want to communicate and talk. We have. I wish I could say what I really feel. Someday I will, but right now I'm afraid to be myself. This is more energy of them showing you somebody else than who you thought they were. You see how this person is wearing a mask? This masculine is wearing a mask. It's like they want to come clean with you and tell you all this stuff that's going on in the background, but you already know. I feel like you already know. Mirrors, I can't validate our love in 3D until I understand our spiritual love in the 5D. Give me some time to explore this aspect so I can be a strong spiritual partner for you. They definitely got some growing to do. They're, they're definitely not in emperor energy. They're more like an emperor in reverse energy. I'm struggling with codependency. I'm afraid to let go of my old coping mechanisms. Yeah. That's for sure. One more. Show me one more. Okay, I got one more. Oh, I got two. No, I didn't. Okay, I got one. I know the universe works in mysterious ways, but sometimes I judge this situation instead of surrendering to it. I mean, obviously, but I don't... It, I'm not even going to try to figure that one out today. I'm just going to give y'all a reading. <laughs> Let's see what the Divine Masculine wants to say to you. What does this Divine Masculine want to say to the twin? I don't know where I stand with you. Yeah. That's because either you guys are not talking to this person. You decided to move on. You're not communicating with them. You know. 
What do they want to say? Okay. <clears throat> I only ask that you never forget me. So they really do feel like you're going to move on without them or you already have, by the way, collective. Okay. One more. We have you are worthy of so much more than I can give right now. Yeah, that's basically what this is about. This whole reading is giving all those vibes. Like, seriously. It is. Um, yeah, but this person is not going to give up. Okay. They're not going to give up. All right. Um, Zodiac signs. We already talked about it, but Libra energy here, Taurus energy here. Uh, Leo, Aquarius, Cancer, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, you know, King of Cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Um, and then we did see the air sign here. And then we saw Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, fire sign come out. Okay. I love you guys. That's your reading. Bye.